Hi, I'm Prairie Conlin. I'm a licensed mental health professional and the clinical director at CertiPet. There's been some recent press that I think should be addressed. Uh, Jared and Ashley from The Bachelor franchise, they made an Instagram post that addresses CertiPet, which is a telemental health platform that is no different from Talkspace or BetterHelp in that it provides referrals for people seeking mental health treatment to licensed therapists. The only difference is that therapists through CertiPet are vetted to have knowledge in animal-assisted therapy interventions that may or may not include an emotional support animal as part of their treatment plan. So this article by Dylan Haffer starts out slamming Ashley by implicating that she is the cause for Jared's panic attacks, which isn't really cool considering panic attacks are very real they're caused by situational as well as organic causes, and they can be terrifying for the person who is experiencing them. Anyway, the article goes on to say that if they really needed a letter, they would get it from their mental health therapist or from their doctor. And you are absolutely right. In fact, we often refer people back to their therapist or doctors if they are currently under treatment. A lot of times they just didn't know and we're more than happy to educate them on how to work with their current doctor or therapist in obtaining an emotional support animal. The problem here is that not everyone has that luxury. Not everyone has a regular primary care physician or a mental health therapist. Not everyone has the ability to take off half a day of work to go into a clinic during regular business hours. And then there are those whose regular doctors and therapists just aren't going to move forward with an animal assisted intervention um, because they aren't trained on that treatment modality. So there are actually quite a few barriers that people encounter when trying to get mental health treatment at all. And then there's also the mental health stigma, which does still exist as we can see here in this current article where it's okay to apparently talk down to and bully someone who has the courage to use their platform to talk about mental health. But let's get to the facts. You assert that websites are ruining emotional support animals for everyone. And we at CertiPet could not agree more with you. Recently, a man certified a beehive through one of these sites. And these sites are absolutely ridiculous. And CertiPet is too quickly lumped in with the same imposters that rubber stamp emotional support animal letters um, that illegally practice across state lines or they fail to recognize that emotional support turkeys and peacocks are an embarrassment to the entire mental health profession. This is not what we do. So making an assumption just by cruising through the website doesn't do anyone any favors. You have to qualify for an emotional support animal. But even if you don't at CertiPet, we're still going to work with you on treatment planning. We are a referral program that maintains a HIPAA secure website and matches clients with therapists licensed in their states. The client then becomes a part of that therapist's private practice. So as far as turning that into an ad and using someone of influence or celebrity to talk about mental health, I don't see the issue in this at all. Michael Phelps advertises for Talkspace. Unfortunately, we still live in a stigmatized America where people still shame mental health. Michael Phelps, it's amazing that you decided to share your story in that you might inspire somebody to get the help that they need. Suicide rates right now are higher than they have ever been in every demographic. We need someone of influence to speak up. What Jared and Ashley did, thank you for your bravery and contribution to speaking up about anxiety. What you have done is incredibly valuable and I hope that this experience doesn't inhibit you or others in voicing your truths about mental health. You are the voice for those who might not have one, and you are the courage that somebody might need. I hope everyone listening that needs help gets help. At CertiPet, we don't care if it's from your therapist or doctor or if it's from us. It's our mission to help people get the help that they need their way. And if they seek help, through the path of the love that they have for their pet, then we're all about that too.